This is a video tour of my exhibit at the Charter House in Red Wing, a senior living facility. Um, I'm uh, Greg Finnegan and uh, I will show you all the paintings. I have hung 62 paintings in this gallery. Hope you enjoy the show. This is the uh, this is my first wall, the winter plein air, and I have uh, seven plein air pieces from uh, painting out at Camp Minogian in uh, along by the Boundary Waters. And I really like canoes, so there's quite a few canoe pictures. Prairie Lakes, plein air, the Prairie Lakes Plein Air from Battle Lake. That can be read. The first one is called uh, Lion and Crocodile, or To the Death. It's from the book She by H. Ryder Haggard. Uh, this was a great tiger I thought I had to paint. Uh, this is Lion and Tiger, and it's based on an illustration from an old book. And this is Die, Star Wolf, Die, based on the book Star Wolf by uh, um, Robert H Hamlin. My master copies, which are eight of the paintings that I did. We have the, the Mona Lisa. We have St. Jerome writing the Bible or by Caravaggio. We have Blue Boy by Gainsborough. And uh, this is a girl in the red hat who's I forget who that is. And then we have Uncle Sam, based on the poster. Then we have a big painting of Bernie, based on his famous uh, mittens at the inauguration. And this is uh, rowing. And this is my favorite one. This is the guy singing by candlelight. And this is uh, the death of Socrates. And the part I liked the best was the guy in the red toga. So I just painted that part of it. And finally, we have Rosie the Riveter, Grand Marais paintings. These two paintings were painted about a half mile from each other in uh, um, Taconite Harbor. Uh, the first one there is actually in gouache, and the second one's in oil. But I use a similar color, so they end up with the same palette. And this one is um, the Cross River, mouth of the Cross River. And there's a studio piece of uh, the Grand Marais Harbor that's frozen. And this is also from Grand Marais Harbor. And that one's in gouache. And the steps here. And uh, this little bridge is in Duluth, right across the road from the, 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 the big mansion there. This one is south of, uh, well, it's not in the right county, but otherwise it would have been in the Battle Lake exhibit. It's south of that, county south of there. This, this is the big boy engine, Union Pacific. They restored it for their anniversary of the Golden Spike. This is the railroad crossing in Red Wing. And the double tunnels over by Winona. And around the corner we have uh, Chamber Tunnel 
uh, in Lake County. And uh, this piece is based on a, a poem for the Poet Artist Competition several years ago about the, the rusty Chevy sitting by the fence. The custom made frame that's put together with uh, barbed wire. And uh, this is the tugboat in Duluth. And this is over in Superior, this barge by uh, Elevator M. There's the list of those paintings. And here we have industrial paintings. Here's the corn water tower that's in Rochester. Uh, this elevator is in the country by Wasika. And uh, this elevator is in uh, Zombroda. And finally, the uh, Zombroda covered bridge. That's from the, uh, the park right there by the depot. This was a couple of years ago when they were building the new bridge and I was over on the Wisconsin side and got the any of the old bridge and the new bridge together. And there's the Barn Bluff. And uh, this is um, the view from the Frontenac State Park looking toward Lake Pepin. And around the corner, we have some more red wing paintings. This is the view from Villa Maria from their back patio. Uh, this is in Red Wing. This is the, uh, the upper quarry where we would have a picnic. And the, this one chunk of rock that still stands up there. This is an old stone house that uh, is in the woods by Hay Creek. And another picture of Barn Bluff. And around the corner we have uh, 3rd Street and Barn Bluff in the background in, Re in Red Wing. And uh, the grain elevator in Red Wing and I'm finally able to catch that little white tug that is constantly moving until I must be taking a lunch break. And there's the boat houses in Red Wing. And uh, this is the view from Grand Avenue or in uh, our Grand View Avenue in Red Wing of the Barn Bluff. And this one's done in gouache. This is based on a photograph. Black, it was a black and white photograph of my parents as they were leaving on their honeymoon in 1950. They're standing in front of uh, my grandfather's 1949 Chevy. This is my son Sam, who plays the bass. Tom, who likes to do Renfest and has a lovely leather hat. And my daughter Megan, who likes to draw and write. This is Cheryl, my wife who had this costume for a play she was doing, and I thought that was a cute hat. And uh, finally, this is a self-portrait.